Hello, well, I'm joined now by Dr. Yumil Ugrinovsky, the general manager of the Neuromedica Center in Macedonia. Welcome. Very good to have you here. And I see that Neuromedica was founded in 1991 as a family business with just five employees and it now provides an extensive range of medical services across the Balkans. What led to this very successful service? How did that come about? Yes, you're right. We started before 25 years, uh, like a family business, with only five employers, and uh, with, but with big perception how uh, uh, health service in Macedonia have to be. It uh, was very interesting in that time because it was the end of uh, one old socialist system, in that time it was ex Yugoslavia, and to be born the new kind of system like capitalist system. And the biggest problem in, the, in that time was the, the, in the minds of the people because all health service in communist systems were free of charge. That means it was very difficult to bring money from the patients. Uh, in that time, one, one Deutsche Mark <laughs> for patients were great money. But with our vision, with our perception, we uh, go step by step. We work very hard and uh, started to, to, to opening uh, clinics in uh, different cities of, of uh, Macedonia. After that, we opened in Greece, uh, in Kilkis. That means that uh, we are present in this moment on European community market. It's very important because we are, that means that we are working uh, with uh, European commun community standards. Uh, in these moments, we have seven clinics, polyclinic diagnostic centers. Uh, two are in Skopje, the capital of uh, Republic of Macedonia. Four are in different cities around uh, in, uh, in Macedonia. And one is in uh, Kilkis in Greece. Uh, we have in this moment more than 120 employers. Uh, more than 50 are doctors. That's a great number. And uh, we have for last year 150,000 patients. That's a great number because uh, you know Macedonia is a small country with only 2 million people. Uh, that means that 7% of all popul population last year use our services. And we are leaders in the region because we have a very, very good quality of services, very good diagnostic uh, equipment, uh, excellent doctors uh, in five, uh, five different kinds of, of medicine. We have the best uh, five professors, uh, which are the best doctors in the region. And so we have a lot of patients from uh, all countries around Macedonia. We have uh, patients from Kosovo, we have patients from all uh, south of Serbia. We have patients from Albania, from Montenegro, a lot of patients from Bulgaria and normally for, for, from Greece because we are present uh, in, in, in the Greece. So uh, our, um, our uh, vision now it's on real way. And till end of the year, we are preparing our new project to finish with that project and to open our uh, hospital uh, will be very big and very uh, big uh, for Macedonia, very big hospital and uh, the hospital which will uh, provide a different kind of, kind of services uh, and with, uh, with uh, modern technology and modern, modern uh, equipment. So. Uh, in that moment, uh, when we will finish with, with that our project, uh, the number of our, our employers will be double than now. Wow. So you are a major contributor to the health services across the region. Yeah. What are you most proud of? I'm most proud 
about our strategy, strategy uh, because we uh, changed, because we, we were the pioneers in of uh, health, private health service in Macedonia. And I'm very proud on, of uh, our strategy, how we, we went step by step and uh, work very hard. And also I'm very proud of uh, some of my doctors, which are very, very, very big professionals and uh, really great doctors. And also normally uh, of my assistants, on, or that's mean our management, uh, which is present in, in Aeromedica. And of course, very good doctors wouldn't come to you unless they thought you were a very good hospital. Yeah, that's normally. Yeah. Uh, exactly. So the fact that you're attracting these excellent doctors is a mark of your quality. Yes, if you, if you have good uh, equipment, good quality, uh, be sure that uh, you will have the, the, the best doctors. In our story is true. And so I'm really proud of, of, of that, uh, that, uh, that uh, good doctors. So you're just about to open your eighth yes. hospital, yeah. medical center. How many more in the next 20 years? Very nice question <laughs> and very interesting. Uh, I hope uh, that we'll have uh, for a short time, I know that uh, our capacity will be full. I mean, with the, the new hospital, and I hope, I hope, and I'm sure, not as hope, I'm sure that uh, for short time we'll start to, to building the second one, our hospital. Fantastic! Thank you very much for taking the time to speak to me today, Thank and you I too. wish you every success for the future, Doctor. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you very much. Thank you.